The American Diabetes Association, every five years, does an economic analysis of the costs of diabetes to society. The last one was done in 2012, published in 2013. In fact, the new one is currently underway. We won't have the results of it until early in 2018. But what we know from the 2012 version is that diabetes was costing the U.S. economy $245 billion. It had gone up 42% from the previous survey in 2007. That's not sustainable. When you look at the costs associated with diabetes, almost half are due to hospitalization. Medical therapy, both for the diabetes and its complications and comorbidities, accounts for about 20%. Physician office visits account for about 9 to 10%. What we're doing is we're backloading all of the costs. If we can intervene in order to A, prevent hospitalizations, B, prevent um, the, uh, the complications of diabetes, and C, reduce medication costs, we're going to have a huge impact on the economics of diabetes.